Floridians do present. <laughs> okay, everybody. Time for another Minecraft Storybook video of the strays where I just died last time. Use my energy more wisely. Bad feeling more will be on the way soon. Guys? Jesse, it was the craziest thing. That clock just vanished from under my nose. I know. Now the situation is just gonna get worse until we get it back. Yeah, from his icy palace of despair, or whatever. Yep. I suppose I'm coming yeah, to you. Cracked. I was happy to stay behind and watch Beacon Town last time you left, but this time I want to do more. If it's to keep Beacon Town safe, I'll do anything. Oh man, proud of you, Radar. <laughs> really? Of course. Well, I, I won't let you down. Okay. All right, everyone, we've got okay. a clock to find. Good job, Radar. And an icy palace of spirit. Can't let you come along on this one, old friend. Hmm. Mm. I promise, I will come back. Hmm. Stay safe, Nerm. Mm -hmm. Stay safe, Nerm. Okay. Hmm. Wait, he has arms. Is that thing gone? Yeah, for that now. Apart. Block this up after we leave, would you? On it. Yes, we will defend Beacon Town with our very lives. Thanks, guys. Bye, Nerm. Yeah, hmm. bye, everyone. I will see we're you all counting on you soon. I wish I knew more about whatever their quest is. Probably not until episode five, though, based on what I know about episode three and four's cover. And five's description, and three and four's description. Well, y you get the point. Stay close. As long as he's in it to win it, and this is. Good. I don't mean to sound suspicious, but do yeah. you really think the admin oh, don't forget is going to keep his word right about this clock? Down here to subscribe yeah, makes it easier for everyone. Get a trustworthy vibe off of him. If he knows what's good for him, he better keep his deal. We get the clock, the town's freed from eternal darkness. Yep. And hey, if he doesn't stick to the deal, we'll just need to find another punchier way to convince him. Yeah, nice trap. Hey, Jesse. Uh, can we, um, talk? I'll just walk yeah. a little more over here. Okay, okay. Uh, right. Uh, 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 me, me, me too. About that trip with Jack. I promise it's not like it seems. It's just a little trip. A little time away from Beacon Town. To, I don't know. Coming back, myself. right? You're gonna come back, right? Right, right, right. Sure. Uh, of course. I... I really yeah, am sorry that you're I have very bad at lying. I was just so excited to be hanging out with real hardcore adventurers again. Especially because I was worried that you that you didn't need me anymore. Oh. Uh, hello. Just because we don't spend as much time together doesn't mean I'm still not your friend, Tummy. Uh, yeah. See, this is why it would have been so much easier if you hadn't found out like this. It's just. Um. Everything's so different from when we first became friends. Everything's changed. Lucas, Axel, Olivia, they all changed too. They found what made them happy. Their thing. But me? I still haven't found mine. Do you know how hard that is? How, how that feels? Your thing is that you help your friends. You're the best friend I've ever had, Petra. Yeah, uh, I guess. Don't tell anyone else that. And, and I Petra. feel the same way about you, of course. The floor's gonna vanish in a second now. 
Oh. Luna? It's just Luna. Uh, is that a scarf on that llama? Huh. Think she ran away again? Uh. We can find out next time. So, uh, everybody, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, most importantly, notification bell. And goodbye, everybody.